Over to a much larger diamond now, Foster Field. The Rams taking on Tarlington State. Texans in game two of the weekend series. Senior Brandon Dusenberry starting on the mound for the Rams. And he wouldn't last long in this one after allowing three hits and one run in the top of the first inning. Brooks goes to the pen and calls on Nick Kaufman, which spells the end of Dusenberry's day. Texans lead by two after one. Top second, Texans still leading two to zero. Jake Spence shoots this one to center field. Jackson Hardy is there for the diving catch. A web gem from him saves a hit, but the Rams still trail heading into the third. Bottom second now, the Rams finally get on the board. The clear falls product, Josh L. Veer smashes this one to right field. That's going to score Knicks again, which the Rams rally back from the early deficit and take game two, five to four. So on to game three we go. The Rams trying to pull ahead in the series against the Texans. Foggy day at Foster Field was also a cold one. Bottom second, Texans leading one to zero, two outs. Jackson Hardy lays down a beautiful bunt down the third base line. That stays just fair. Good skill by Hardy, and the Rams have a runner on first. A couple pitches later, Hardy is going to swipe second with the steal. That's going to set a runner up in scoring position. Still down by one, though. But the Rams can't capitalize. Michael Curdy strikes out swinging to end the inning. But the Rams bounce back from the slow start to take it 6-1. to one.